The students here today are actually in the human osteology or fragmentary osteology class, which we have a very unique resource here where we have an entire wall that's filled with fragmentary remains and human remains. We get donated bodies, which allows the students to have hands-on experience. So instead of just learning bones from the books or from pictures, they sit here throughout lab about probably around 10 to 20 hours a week actually studying the bones, touching the bones. I chose this program and I chose Mercer because there's a couple things that I was looking for school when I was a senior in high school coming to look at schools and one of them was I wanted to be a name not a number so I wanted to go to a small school that had that personal feeling and I wanted to do a program that was really strong in the forensic sciences and you can't find those everywhere so here at Mercer as soon as I came for my tour I kind of got the best of both worlds. Um, I wanted them to know my name, uh, recognize me and I think it's very easy to distinguish yourself, um, to pursue your interests here and to be able to gain the experience with faculty members that are you know very well recognized well published if you're sort of uh, interested in forensics but you're not really sure where you want to take that as a, as a career path you are able to explore lots of different options right off the bat right from the start you are interested in bones and they're put in your hands you have a number of specimens here at our disposal that we can work with and really get the practice we need you're not working with the plaster cast that a lot of other school have you have the donated bodies and you get to see all the different human variation which prepares you for your career in the field. We started in 19, 1991 here at Mercier's with the, the archaeology program and decided early on that the main focus of the program would be not only archaeology and, and some physical anthropology but the hands-on experience. So we allow undergraduates in the last few years to become involved in the forensic cases um, both in the laboratory and, and even in the field. We do um, on average about a hundred cases a year and so the students get get a lot of experience there. We prepare students to to work in laboratories and crime labs uh, to also work in the field as investigators, um, but the primary focus is to promote the sciences and move the, the students on to masters and PhD programs.